Hey everyone, Ian from Chosen Few Software here. I'm sure all of you know about VHS, a now obsolete tape-based analog video format that was extremely popular between the late 70s and early 2000s. Throughout those years, many of us fell in love with the format's distinct analog aesthetic and the memories associated with it. Today, video producers around the world long to give their content the trademark VHS look, and although several commercial solutions exist, we believe none of them managed to capture the true magic of VHS. So it is with great excitement that I announce Chosen Few Software's latest and greatest piece of software, Save. Save, above anything else, is software. This means that anyone with a computer can give their videos the signature VHS look without the need for real hardware such as VCRs, VHS tapes, and video capture devices. Next up is analog video. Traditionally, videos are manipulated by software on a pixel-per-pixel -pixel basis, running the same set of operations on each pixel of each frame. This filter model, as it's called, is fast and easy to implement, and is the basis of most existing software solutions. This approach works fine in most cases, but it is a far cry from how data is actually processed and stored on VHS. This brings us to the final word, emulation. Essentially, Save acts like a VCR living inside of your computer, treating incoming data as a continuous electrical signal. This virtual flow of electricity is then manipulated based on the mathematics of real analog circuitry, according to official VHS specifications. This approach is what separates Save from existing solution, leading to results that are not only aesthetically pleasing, but also accurate, repeatable, and adjustable. Take a look. So at this point you're probably wondering, how can I get SAVE and how much does it cost? Well, to answer the first question, SAVE's main functionality meets all the goals for its initial release. However, it's not yet in a user-friendly state. We currently have plans for an integration with Chosen Few Effects, our flagship video effects plugin, and work will begin on that soon. For the second question, it all depends on consumer interest. If enough people are interested, a private pre-release testing group will be organized so that we can receive feedback from video producers like you and help narrow down pricing. If you're at all interested in SAVE, let us know in the comments section or email us at info at Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys soon.